So in this lesson, we're going to talk about backing up our projects, which is probably one of the most important things we can do. Anything you do that's project-based or any um, document you're working on that you need, um, that you may need in the future, you better have it backed up. Uh, computer disks, hard disks fail all the time. Um, the data can get corrupted. In Unity, you can bring an asset in that turns everything pink, etc. So we need to make sure that the project is backed up. And if something like that happens, you just go to Google Drive, restore the latest um, uh, project that you have, uh, open it up, and you're ready to go. In this lesson, we're going to talk about backing it up. So first of all, before we do something, we want to make sure we're saving a bunch of scenes. So you can see I have scenes here, and they, they um, play controllers, XR interactions, so I know that these scenes, what I've done in this particular scene. So in this case, when I play it, my uh, simulator is working, and I can move around and do my uh, controllers. So if I was saving a new scene, I would file, save as, and I'm just going to save this one again. I could type in a new name. I could make it XR Interaction 1 if I wanted to, if I did something else. And then, anytime I do something, then I make sure I save a scene. Okay, that's the scene. Now, if I'm going to go ahead and back up the project, then I would get out of this, and I would go to my file folder, and I would find it. Now, if you don't know where your project is, um, you can go to the hub. Here's mine, um, Documents, Unity 2023, Create with VR. So, um, let's go to it. Documents, Unity 2022-23. Yeah, I don't see it there. Maybe I have it in my VRs. Okay, so here's a bunch of projects, VR project here. Okay, that looks more like a game. That's a project. So if you see assets, library, logs, etc., this is a project. So um, I would go ahead and right click I'm on a PC um, send to compressed so and then it would be compressed you're seeing it's going to be right here all right the most important thing is you know where it is so when you go to unity hub you when you create a new project you put it where you want it means you better be choosing this don't let unity put it where it wants to you choose where you want it to go and you don't let it have this name like VR and then you choose where it's going to go you choose the folder so here's where my well, but I could change this I could go to documents I could change it to uh, unity um, 2023 I could change it to unity VR um, right here I could put it there wherever I want to choose it let's say I choose that now I select that folder. That's where it's going to go here, and I give it a name. So but this will tell you where your current project is. So if I go back, there it is compressed. Okay? So now I have the folder, the project, with all of this in it, assets, library, logs. That's the project I'm opening. Not a scene, not a game, etc. And then I would go to my, in this case I'm using Google Drive, GitHub, whatever you want to use. doesn't matter to me. Um, but and you can see I don't have a Unity 2024, 2023 here, and I don't have a Unity VR. So let's go ahead and do that. So new folder, Unity VR, and let's just say 2023. Let's say 22 to 23. I have my new folder. There it is. So I want to go get that folder. 
I'm going to go New, File Upload, and I'm going to go back to Documents. Unity VR. Um, VR project. That wasn't it. There it is. And I would just click on this. And it's going to load it. All right. So how often should we do this? We should do it a lot. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. So especially if you're using Google Drive, which 100 gigs free, uh, I suggest you use it. Um, there it is. So the next lesson we'll talk about bringing it back, but all you do is you just click on it and you download and you download anyway. And there it is. I would go see it in the folder. And when it's done, I would just click on it, and I would uncompress it. So click, extract, extract all, and get rid of this last place here so it doesn't go inside the folder, inside the folder, and hit extract. So make sure you back them up all the time. So the next one would be VR Zip 1 or ABC. I'd have all the latest versions up here. Maybe if I get like 10 of them, I may get rid of the first two. But every week, back it up. Don't get rid of the other one. And then no matter what happens, you're ready to go.